First, let's shuffle the deck four times. Let's see what is the overall energy. The full card. Wanting to have a restart regarding this connection with the person that is on your mind currently. Wanting to give it another chance. Let's see more details. First I will see what happened in the past and why it all happened. And then there are possible actions towards you, if any, at the end of this reading. So, in the past, what happened? There may have been a long-distance relationship, or the long-distance um, was a problem. For some of you, it was a third-party situation, let's hope not. But a deep... Uh, deep problems uh, regarding connecting with each other, respecting each other. Some of you may have recently talked or uh, messaged this person. It seemed like there was some message, a call or a meeting with them that happened uh, immediately. But you soon disconnected from each other. So take what resonates. Now let's see what is affecting you in your subconscious that you may not be aware of. It is the Queen of Cups. So you have deep feelings for them. You still love them. Even though you may not want to accept it, for some of you, your love is deep and powerful for this person. Let's see how you view the situation, Queen of Swords. You want to view it from another viewpoint. You want to view it as a, as a Queen of Swords. You want to Listen now to your mind and not your heart. You want to see things logically, <clears throat> based on facts and not uh, on emotions. Let's see about the current energies. King of Cups and the Judgment. Yes, again, it is this... Uh, I see many court cards as well. Let's hope again it was not a third party situation because too many people here. Queen of Swords... Queen of Cups, King of Cups, Three of Cups in the reverse. Let's hope it was not a third party situation. But again, at the current situation, I still see you wanting to express your feelings to this person. And if you had the chance, you'd say yes for a reconnection. Let's see about the focus. Yes, here it is, Four of Wands and your hope. Your hope is to reconnect to this person person. You, your hope is to plant the seed of commitment in that relationship with them and to take the connection to the next important step that is making informal engagement or marriage. Let's see what is happening with them. They have the emperor. You may be dealing with an Aries for some of you or they may have Aries in their chart. Five of swords. They seem a bit upset, but more mature in love. I think they, they have learned their lessons. They may know now what uh, went wrong, what they did wrong. Yes, they want to message you. They, they are ready for a restart. They want to come forward to you and tell you that they have attraction for you. Until now, they are holding tightly back. Why? Because they fear the conflicts may reappear. They fear if you reconnected now, there would be still arguments or they may not be well welcomed. They fear you may reject them in some way or they fear the, the same conflicts and arguments may reappear again in the connection. 
Now let's see their possible actions towards you, Eight of Pentacles. I see them also focused on their career a lot. Uh, let's see more details about regarding this connection. Four of Wands. They are very determined now to work through all the steps of this uh, connection, through all the challenges to make that uh, dream of yours, your focus, uh, it was commitment, stability, making that connection formal, engagement or marriage, uh, they want that, the same thing as you. Queen of Swords in the reverse. The problem is that they are a bit angry, they are a bit upset, that's why they are not expressing their feelings. Ace of Swords, they want to talk with clarity and honesty. If this person was in a third party situation and they didn't tell you that before, or you didn't know about it, they want to tell it to you. That's why they may fear some arguments here. Too many court cards as well, so again, third party situation, another person may have been involved in the uh, in the breakup of that relationship. But I see them uh, being very attracted towards you, and um, also I, I see more attraction from them than love. So they want to celebrate the love, the, the love with you. They want to move the connection to the next important step, but I see more attraction than love from this person. And they are a bit upset about how all that happened. But it is important that they are willing to work hard in order to, to save the connection or repair the damage that was done. So both of you want to restart, you are ready here for a yes, if they came and offered or expressed their love to you. I see them wanting to reach out and message you and tell you that important message that they want to be with you and uh, they want to be with you long term. Now I will continue this reading in the extended, where I want to view more about the energies of this spread like how does your person feel now? Let's see more details. Also, how do they view you now? What are their intentions for the current moment? And at the same time, I will look at the mutual energies and the energies around each one of you. If you want to watch the extended, you can find it in the description box below. See you the next reading and bye for now.